Okay, so okay, so today I thought we might be doing something different, and that's for two reasons. Number one is that I haven't filmed much this weekend. Here's everything I filmed. It's not like that's the only stuff that happens, it's just that that's the only stuff I want to share with you. All the other stuff is stuff that you had to be there to experience. It's stuff that I liked, moments that I really love to have shared with the people around me that don't belong in the internet. See, my current goal is to be a filmmaker. I guess I am, because I've made a few short films, but I also made a huge amount of films that never got made or finished. Today's vlog is going to be about short film I gave up on and that I should have finished. I never finished this short film because I wanted it to be like a creature feature horror film about giant mice that terrorize a medieval village. Very obviously that doesn't work, it didn't work, so I was really frustrated and didn't finish it. And right now looking at it, I think it could have been an interesting short film, it really not a horror short film at all, but maybe something interesting and funny. It could have been interesting, should have. I really should have kept working on it. It was a big amount of work, I, I, it took almost over an entire weekend to shoot all of this. It's, it's, I mean, it's impossible to get a mouse to do what you want if, if the mouse isn't trained and I never trained a mouse before in my life. You know, we had to build and arrange all these miniature sets. So many hours, never really finished it. Because at the moment I was really frustrated. It, it didn't come out like I wanted it to. Of course it didn't, because it's not a setting for a horror movie, very obviously. Look at the look at the mouse. She's way too cute. I guess what I'm trying to say and what I'm trying to learn for myself is don't give up on things because you see the mouse in this movie? It used to be a pet mouse of mine. She's been dead for over five years. Time passes and you forget. You forget what you want to do, you forget what you want to try. Everything around you. It's going to die someday. Flowers die, pets die. Every day, little pieces of you die on a little microscopic level. Your ideas die if you don't act on them. Don't let them, don't let them die in your head. Don't give up on what you want to do. I think the biggest reason why this is kind of frustrating it's because I feel like every year I get older, I get less creative. I get less likely to take a chance and do something I want to do and I believe in. And seeing how I didn't act on stuff I believed in in the past, that's a regret I don't want anyone to have. I think it's normal to give up on a project, but I think I give up or used to give up way too easy on those. The vlog has been a nice exercise for this because I had to make a short film like every other day. I made that I made vlogs for about 16 days in the last month, so I had like a 50% success rate in vlogging and a 50% fail rate. That's pretty good. That's 50-50. I want to learn to apply this quota to every other project I'm working on. If I only quit half the stuff I'm working on, life's gonna be good. I guess if I'm trying to say anything, finish it. Even if it doesn't seem like a good idea at the time, finish your project and maybe in time it's something cool, something funny even, you know? Maybe not what you wanted it to be, but something.